actually got a question for you, Tommy, and I'm really not trying to offend you. If you start off with that, <laughs> <laughs> I hope that you really don't feel like that. I don't feel like that's what I was trying to tell her. Like, I was going to say that. That was going to be our close. Anybody that knows me knows I like a conversation for the sake of the conversation. Okay. At the end of... Hold that. I mean, your brain. I just want you to hold that. Hold that. What he just said in your brain. Okay. Conversation. I'm like the. I, I, I was in debate club. I, when you get through with it, you shake hands. When you get through playing basketball, you don't get mad because you won or you lost. It's a part of the competition. Okay. We are supposed to be here to entertain, enlighten, and educate a little bit. Okay. And Once again, hold that thought. Hold it. Hold. Continue. I was talking to her. I was just trying, and the same with you or anybody else. I challenged them. Yeah. You should want to be challenged if you're having a discussion. Why is it that we can only talk to people who agree with us? Yeah. Once again, hold that thought. Hold, hold your holding. Hold. Give me back in your mind. Continue. That's what's making America like soft. So can I ask soft. that question? So I don't know if you've seen I don't follow you. Oh, oh shit. The only you gonna re me? I, I will, but only if it's convenient for me to, to follow you. Oh, so can you turn that shit off? Please? No, they can hear they can hear you. Go ahead. Okay, so I unfollowed you because every time I go on my Instagram, I see you downplaying black women. As in to the point where Continue. Continue. I don't see no other race, but you always posting something about a black woman did this or what they were doing. And I'm like, nigga, you black yourself. What are you doing? So I got tired. What you coughing over there? Relax. What's up? Go ahead. Black women did this or what they were doing. And I'm like, nigga, you black yourself. What are you doing? So like, I got yeah. tired of seeing it. And I want to just say, the one that got to me, the one that made me unfollow you, was the one that, wow, it was the one with the, the, the lady that had the wig or something like that. And I guess, you know which one I'm talking about. I don't, because I talk but, about ladies and wigs a lot. So I was like, what? Exactly, and they're all black. So it's just like, <laughs> it's just like, so it's just like, it's like, I was cool. You know, I was really cool, everything. But what, what was why, it all that that bothered you? What um, it was um, specifically, you were saying something about, um, I guess, uh, she was playing you or something. Somebody that reported your page. I don't really know. I don't follow you about a week ago, so I really don't remember. It was around my dad's death, but I didn't want to see it on my TL. Because I'm like, damn, Tommy, like, I thought you were better than that. Better than what? Well, okay. I, I, was, I explain to people like this. One, I don't understand why black women get to tell a black man because you're black. You can't talk about this group. When no, the, when, you can. Well, hold on. If you want me, if you go to ESPN, you're going to get sports. You're not going to get politics. You're going to get sports. So when people come to me, they're going to hear me talk about what I think is the problem. Okay. I think we have a lot of issues, and I think they are starting with the idea of our women. So I will speak on that. Now you can go to another guy and hear him tell Young Pharaoh tell you about how black women are God and then cheat on y'all and beat you. You can go hear that if you want. But I think it's okay. So this is a problem. This is the first issue I have. Okay. I said this, uh, I want to say it was roughly, well, was, it, was it May of last year, April of last year, with Derek Jackson and Kevin Samuels. I said this about a, roughly a year ago. Um, the problem I have with them two brothers, right? Balance. One is completely parenting the women. One is, is holding women accountable, but disrespectful, right? Why can't you do both? Why can't you hold... When black women, I'm talking to black women, I'm not, I'm, not, I'm not in any other community. I'm only in the black community, so I'm going to speak about black women. I don't deal with black women. Why can't you hold black women accountable, right, and still uplift them at the same time? It's, it's not that difficult. It really is not. And the problem I have is, what he just said is, yes, there are some black women that you can't tell them nothing. Wait till I get my money, right? Oh, you can't tell them. By the way, we gotta watch that genius documentary. But anyway, go, go. Um, I'm not getting that Donna too though. I'm, I'm sorry. I 
I, I ain't got it. I can put some on it. I got five on it. Uh, the problem is, I've seen Brother Tommy's videos, right? And he does have points to where he holds black women accountable. Yes. At the same time, he disrespects them. Now, people will, Brother Tommy will use that as, I'm entertaining, I'm being fun, it's just words, it's just things like that. But when you have, when you are an influencer, your powers, words have power, right? Words have power. You're never going to get me ever on any platform, on YouTube, on social media, on Twitter, or IG, ever call a black woman out her name, ever disrespect her looks, ever. I ain't gonna say, okay, I ain't gonna say ever. If it like it might be a meme, I might I might go crazy on a meme or something like that. But you, nine times out of ten, you're not gonna see me going crazy talking about a woman's wig or clothes or body shaming. I'm not gonna do that because black women are gods, just like black men are gods. We are gods. Right? I'm not I'm not an astrologist and not all that. I do believe we are gods. We are God's children, therefore we are we are made in his and therefore we are gods. I am a god. Going back to yay, I do this. But I do have that issue. That yes, you can hold black women accountable, but don't have to be disrespectful. That's the issue I think that she's referring to. Pop possibly. Right? And plus once again, making fun of, talking about wigs and stuff. Okay, that's cool. But just sometimes you overdo it, bro, from what I've seen. But we continue. Not that you're willing to listen to somebody tell you how great you are and you're kings and queens and how you're the most beautiful thing on the earth, but you're not listening to somebody say the other side. It's the same thing I was saying on the discussion. Why not hear more than one side? So you can go to somebody else and hear them tell you all the things that make you feel good. Mm -hmm. Come to me, I'm going to tell you the opposite because why do you need to hear that? And the last thing is, I grew Let me address that real quick. Why do we need to hear that? And specifically, black women? It's because they are. What's, I mean, I wish I remember the sister's name going back to like the summer of 2020 after George Floyd. No, it was uh, after No Name J. Cole. Right, I watched his sister. She was talking about the pyramid and how black people are at the bottom of the pyramid, right? In terms of society, and black women and black men are on the side of each other. So we only have each other because everybody else in society, white people, even his, like everybody is above us. So and we diss each other, like there's no farther down we can go. Like we're dissing each other, like like well. The walls that we have, or we're dissing each other in this pyramid called society. So, and black women in the history, through the history of time, have been degraded more than any other entity. I <laughs> have been degraded. Black women have been degraded, yet they took took care of a lot of these people's kids. They've been asked to take care of a lot of these people's kids, but been degraded more than anybody else in history, in society. Right? They need to hear, we be reaffirmed that they are queens, just like we need to be reaffirmed that we are kings. You hear me? You feel me? You hear me or you feel me? You're going to be all right. So that's why. That's why. Go ahead. Family, most of us grew up around black folks. If you grew up with a black mom, a black grandma, a black aunt, it's funny how we listen to those who, talk, who supposedly love us talk to us and say, sit your black ass down, don't do this, slap you in the gate. You can listen to your mama who had you talk to that way, but not a guy who you don't know, who you could simply unfollow. That lets me know. Yes. Because <laughs> I, I, I know, like you said, I know most likely that person loves me and wants the best for me. So, yeah. They might tell me, they might tell me, sit your black ass down, do this, that, that. But I know this out is still, even if it's out of anger, it's still within love too. A random person telling you that don't have no love for you, don't care for you, right? So why am I listening to somebody I don't know disrespect me? <laughs> that makes no sense. 
You said the person that loves you, why would you listen to a person that loves you rather than a person that doesn't? That doesn't make sense. Why would I want to listen to a person that I don't love? <laughs> it doesn't love it doesn't love me. No, I'm not listening to that person. Now, some people do have good intentions, and they are, but it's just like Kevin like Samuels. I know he has good, part of me believes he has good intentions, and he is helping to an extent, but it just the, the, the way he does it, the delivery, it, 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 it really bothers me, because we can have cordial conversations, and sometimes he does, but he got popular because of the way he speaks in some of the stuff he says I don't agree with. Um, but it's like, you might even have my best interest at heart, but it still is on your delivery. How you deliver the message. If people don't care about the messenger, why are they going to listen to the message? When I'm saying, F you, F you, F you, and you look like this, you do that. Why well, am I going to listen to you after that? You're a five, you're a four, you're not, you don't deserve none of that. Why am I going to listen to you? So I can follow someone and I will argue not you're black so you can't talk about blacks. I'll say, does what you say have merit? I don't care if a white person is talking about blacks. Because here's what's funny. You don't want a black man to talk about black women. But if a white woman did it, would you listen to that? No. Nope. I do want to point out, I feel very uncomfortable that we're having this discussion in front of white folks. I, I, don't, I hate that. Like, because they, they're damn sure not going to say, yeah, they're not going to say nothing. Because this is a, a king and queen conversation. <laughs> in the kingdom, we not letting no 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 stragglers outsiders in on the conversation because they have nothing to input because they don't they're not in this community. So I feel I always felt comfortable when we do this in front of in front in front of people in public. Like when we do this in front of people, I hate that. Like if it was a room for the black folk, I would love. It. But if that is a room for the uh, white folk, and I don't know what they are, folk. It's just like uh, 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 makes me uncomfortable. You say she was racist. If anybody else did. So who can talk about it? So my problem, my, well, I ain't going to say problem. My whole debate is why only you only target black? Like, I'm pretty sure white well, people get on you too. Uh -uh, Dominican people get on you too. Uh -uh. Why you don't, why you don't uh, um, say because something don't. about them? When I say Come white on women. Come now. I know I, every race gets get on your ass. No. You're when I, say, when I say white women got flat, I did a whole song about white women and they flat. We ain't talking about those songs. <laughs> <laughs> we talking about your Maybe. posts. <laughs> Maybe when I say something about white people, they eat it. Yeah, because he's black. They eat it. I can get up in the front of a comedy set, and I've done it several times, make fun of the white people in the audience. They, <laughs> they eat it. They're yeah. not sitting around wearing their emotions on their shoulders, and white men don't go around talking about some call me king because we created the earth. There's only <laughs> one group of people who keep giving themselves false praise. You want to get mad that somebody's talking about somebody wearing a Okay, queen. but we should have every right to feel that we you can. You can, and I have every exactly. right to say what I, but listen exactly. what you I don't you, go you, to the other You should know side. our background. No, but I... Yes, so if I want exactly. to speak on so it because we should I, have every right Jay, to Jay, feel that way. Talking, no, I, I on, speak Jay. on it because I know the background. So if you can go on your stuff and talk about how great you are, and I don't go on there and tell you you can't, mm -hmm. why would you fuck? And, the, and the, just the whole white folk taste off and eat it. Yeah. They'll, they'll eat any, they'll, they'll pause. That's crazy. They'll handle anything except they'll call them racist. You call them racist, see how they handle that. That's the one thing you can't do with a white person. or the, Call them racist, they're going to run out of there. Right? Talk about racism, they're going to run out of there. Why? Because racist is the only thing that they can have guilt or feel a way about. Anything else, they're on top of the pyramid, like I said before. In society, they're on the top of the pyramid. Why would somebody at the bottom of the period, period, pyramid, talking... Talking up to them will feel any way. That's like a kid talking down to you. You can't talk down to me because you're a kid. <laughs> so, of course, they're going to eat dumb whatever. But when we say it makes it valid, when black men degrade black women, it makes it valid. When black women degrade black men, it makes it valid. Once again, because we on, at the bottom of the period, 
pyramid next to each other, right? We deal, deal with, with each other more than any uh, anybody else. We know our history, like you said, more than anybody else. You know our struggles more than anybody else. Now, at a comedy show, yes, you shouldn't be If you're going to be sensitive at, sensitive at a comedy show, don't go to a comedy show. I hate when people get sensitive and get mad. And, but, bro, you got a comedy show, you get angry. Same thing with Twitter and do all these hashtags about, bro. It's a comedy show. It's comedy. Same same reason I got mad at people when they got mad at Kevin Hart. I got mad at Dave Chappelle. Again, mad now at Joe Rowe. Like, it's comedy, bro. Now, some of that stuff maybe took it too far. And out of context, anything can be made to look malicious. But that's comedy. So I do agree. So we are, we can be sensitive. Absolutely. But I think she's speaking to more once again. And that goes to her. Good that she unfollowed him because if it makes you feel a way to see whatever he's posting, then unfollow him. That's it. You don't got to do a long blog or go to the press, go to TMZ, say that, okay, don't like what he's posting, unfollow him. Have a good rest of your day. A lot of people too too many times don't realize you can close your phone or or uh, put your phone on do not disturb or close your laptop you, or turn off the TV. You don't have to watch this stuff. That's why I don't never understand. Like it's not that big of a deal. Close your, close your devices. Go on with your day. But continue. Be see what I say, then come tell me what I can't say. When you said you can say what you want. That's true enough. I always say this. Black women love to say how strong they are. Mm -hmm. If you're really strong, other people's opinion shouldn't bother you that much. It don't bother you. You know, you're the most un, you're the most bothered, why would you want to talk about your own race? They're not, listen, see what you're saying? Why would you want to talk about your own race? But if I sit there and said how great they were, you wouldn't say, why would you want to talk about your own exactly. race? So all I, like I can do is big up a group of people? I wouldn't. So I wouldn't. all I can do is big up a group of people. You got to go to somebody else. Go to another dude who talk and big you up. I won't because it's not my job. It, 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 you live in America, but you can talk bad about America. They don't shoot you out. He said, just missed you. the logic. Yeah. Completely yeah. missed the logic. No, and what he's saying is that no one is above criticism. Mm -hmm. Regardless of where the criticism comes from, it is if it's a valid critique, a fact is a fact that does not change based on who's necessarily said They it. never argue what I say. It's just I'm black and I can't say it, which is a childish argument. You can say a whatever. midget can't talk about midgets because he's small. <laughs> a nah. fat girl can't talk about fat girls because she's fat. That's a good comparison. It is that's silly. A, that's a great and like comparison. I said, when I brought Shout up out there, to the, I'm always going to bring, bring them up anytime I get Patrice O'Neill. So just because uh, I look at a fat person saying fat. <laughs> and the person replies back, <laughs> Text one, like, who are you to talk? <laughs> like, it's like, like, because I'm fat. I can, because I'm fat doesn't mean I can, can't tell you that you're fat. Like, well, I have eyes still. So I agree with that. We can all, anybody can criticize anybody. Um, but it hurts more when it's your own people that does it. But once again, sometimes it's critique. Sometimes it's just a pain. Sometimes it's disrespect. It depends on it depends what it is, it depends on the person, it depends how you, you know. So look at him. American. They were born in America, but sat right here and dissed the American government and said, All they do is lie. So well, you can dip, but you're American. Okay. And my point is Well, first of all, we were born here because we were shipped over here, but no 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 sort of another day like I didn't I didn't ask to be an American. I was shipped over here. Like oh we all were being can't take cloth right now or naked. Like, in the, like, it has to be here. But another story for another day. I'm just saying. Like, um, yeah, you know what? No, that's no, no, a whole other video. I, every time I get on Instagram, you're the only person that's saying the same thing about black women, though. Like, okay, you're the only. What is he saying, though? Because that's what, that's probably what we can get down to. What, what are these, all these women thinking right now? I'm wondering that. But, um, I want to. No, we're not gonna get into that. We're not gonna get into that. He, I know his views on black women. I got to do search on. Um, but continue. Like they, they, they people say what they say about fresh and fit, but I don't see it every day on them. Every time I go on my Instagram, you're just specifically only targeting black women, and I didn't like that because I'm like, damn, it ain't that deep. You don't gotta go that hard. What? So, you know what I find interesting? Why are they laughing? Uh, what is so funny to them? 
Like, and I didn't like that because I'm like, that. what is so funny to Fresh and Fit? They're looking back at each other. What is so funny to y'all? Like, why are y'all laughing? Like, what is funny about if a black woman is saying, I don't like that y'all, you continue to I feel like you're talking down to me. And they're just like, <laughs> like, what are y'all laughing about? Like, I'm not, I don't understand that. Like, what are y'all laughing about? Like, it's kind of weird. Like, like, you completely invalidated her whole, like, how she feel. And that's the point. <laughs> that is the point. <laughs> like, you completely not even listen to what you say and just invalidate it. It's like, <laughs> And then anytime, anytime Tommy speak, it's gospel. That's the whole point. <laughs> it's the same thing y'all saying. <laughs> it's funny. Y'all doing the same thing that y'all saying the black women are doing. You're completely invalidating what, what she's saying. Not even listening to her for real. Just listen to her butt. It's like, I think it's a joke. You don't got to go that hard. So what somebody says something about you, that don't mean you got to do a whole post about a black person. I'm pretty sure white people, Dominican people, a post about a white girl right people, there. everything say about you. Is, is he you. diminishing them or perfecting them? He's he literally difference. tagging the people. And you ever said that? Uh, no, I'm not. Okay, I ain't gonna say you're tagging. See, that's but you're what I'm putting saying. Their you're picture, just saying you're putting things. their picture on there. So you get. You the, are. I'm looking at my. You I'm are. looking at my Instagram right now. And I my follow. phone Instagram. I do you have a lot. Do you have a lot? But I'm looking at my Instagram right now. The only way that I felt some Instagram way is because it's because like it's no other race you go so hard on but your own kind. Because he cares. Like, uh, listen. If he cares, he wouldn't go so hard. You don't on tell it. me how to do what I do. I got my psychology degree. You didn't. Okay, so if you but to, I did study more psychology I've so I know more the people difference. than you. I've had- All right. So this is where, this is where, you know, it's funny. I didn't even see this part yet. I haven't gotten this far. So I don't even know what, I have an idea what happened at the end and what happened in the beginning. I never saw all of this. So this is, this is fun now. Because now, I didn't even know he's going to go that route. So, like I said, what he did was invalidate what she said. By saying, I got a psychology degree. You don't, dumb nigga. So, I know how to... That's basically what he said. That's what she said. That's what she said. Imagine what she said. Once again, I wish she would be specific. The, the problem is, she's not really helping her case. Because she's not being... being Like, giving a specific example. Like, what is an example of what he's doing? Right? So, I can't even really defend her if I wanted to because she's not giving a real example of what what she's talking about. Outside of he's posting pictures and making fun of him. It's like, uh, well, you don't follow him, so it's it cool. I don't even know why this is still a discussion. Um, it seems like he, she, I, I will give you this, she's just not going to get, I, I think, in all honesty, she's not going to be happy, happy with what any answer you get. <laughs> she's not going to be ha- happy with any answer Tommy gives. So she's really just repeating herself. And he's like, hey, this is what I do. Don't like it. It is what it is. And she's going to keep saying, but why? It's like, I keep telling you because it's what I do. But why? It's like, bro, I told you. <laughs> so I, I could see, I can understand Brother Tommy's frustration for sure. But when he starts doing that slick stuff, talking about I got a degree you don't, and you acting, he's doing this little slick, slick talk. She's being calm, but you can see it in her face. She's not going to be calm too much longer. He's the one that's starting to, but, cause I, it's like, bro, relax. It's not that serious. It's not that serious. He's the one that's starting to, act calm, starting to get defensive. It's like, relax, bro. I thought you said you could have a calm, I thought you could have a civil conversation and love having a base. Didn't you say that? You said that. In the beginning, you said that. Okay, go ahead. More people say I've of changed course, their life and saved their life. Of course, you're 30-something. I'm only 25, no, I'm but I'm very smart and wise for my age. The point is, do it oh, your 25. way. Oh, 25, you're still a baby. <laughs> She's 20, oh, I thought she was still, she's still a baby. Oh, nah. At least, at least get into the 28, 29 club before you can even, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, 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 all right. But go ahead, though, go ahead. That doesn't validate, but it's like, uh, anybody like like that's under like twenty seven. I kind of like ah, I don't even want to have a talk. 
<laughs> but that doesn't invalidate her stance. If she had a, I wish she had an example. Though. Like I wish she had a. But anyway, we have to do it mine. Of course. But I'm letting you know. It I, but I didn't you care. Go but I don't care. Way about it. But I don't care. You do it. If you, know to, if you know how to build a house better than me, you build it. Don't tell me to do it. Okay, but I'm Damn. just letting you know. If I'm only time that no I see, if I'm going on my I Instagram, that's exactly I why don't I don't care who follows me. Because I don't care. I don't though. see nothing else but black but people I that you post care. on your page. So, so you don't talk that. about no I other race. I don't care. Anybody that wants to follow me, unfollow me now. I will say that. You can't even follow my bank account. I'm still rich, so I don't care. It don't matter. What? Yo, it infuriates me when niggas go to money. When women or men or women go to money, what the hell does that got to do? When that literally has nothing to do with nothing. Like, you know, they, you know, somebody getting frustrated when they start going to, but my money says, it's like, nigga, nobody asking you about your money. Nobody's asking you that you get flowed out. Nobody's asking you that you be in, you know, nobody asks you that. When somebody start going to money, that lets you know they're in their feelings. Because they feel money is the root of, you know, whatever. So they, they, they okay, if I'm, if I'm, if I'm losing all, I feel like, you know what, let me go to, let me go to the money bag real quick. It's, a, it's like, bro, it's, okay, go ahead. Money don't make nobody. No, apparently it does. If you do the shit Obviously, you saying you do for it. Money don't make nobody. <laughs> you gonna sit there and talk bad about the thing that you talked up. Jesus, why wouldn't someone listen to you when you say, I understand you don't like watching it. Don't watch it. That's why I, I don't follow, like gay porn. Nigga, I don't go around I looking for follow. it. I don't follow. I don't follow. I don't care. Okay, that's I don't day. care. Jesus Christ. I don't two weeks ago. Ago. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I don't follow you, you either. Do. Okay. So this is where... It was scary. Remember in the beginning, it's it's uh, oh man, I, I love I love me some me. It's funny because I only saw the first minute of this, and I saw what happens at the end. But something told me because I know brother Tommy how this was going to go. <laughs> Once again, he's escalating this when you start cussing, escalating when you start saying I don't care and raising your tone. She was she's basically been not yelling. She's been kind of. Cool the whole time. He's raising his voice. He's the one getting. It's like, bro, I thought you were supposed to be. <laughs> I thought you loved civil conversations. Huh? I thought you loved civil debates. Psychology degree. Why are you getting amped? Huh? If you don't care to say. Okay, I understand. Move on. When you learn to do that. You don't have, this would have been done, like, if this was me, this would have been done, like, at the three-minute mark. <laughs> I'm like, hey, this is what I do. Because I feel, because I can do what I want to do with my, my IG. I talk about everybody. If you feel the way, I understand that. But it is what it is. I want to move on. There's nothing, like, there's nothing to debate. <laughs> this is no debate. You want to follow me? Cool. Do what you got to do for your mental health. And I would have moved on. So, I don't know. You brought it up. Obviously, you, you do because brought it up. Look at how hard you're a, getting mad. Too, because you keep talking about it of like course. I'm supposed to give a fuck. You unfollowed. Obviously, you, you had care. to announce it. You know I don't give a fuck. You though. had to announce you know, it, sir. Of course, I'm going to announce Jesus it. Jesus Christ. You're fucking awesome. That's the question. You're fucking awesome. You sound insane. <laughs> no, you sound insane. You're bothered by what I post. I don't and know what you're saying. You're insane. Once again, invalidating what she's saying. Well, go ahead. Because I didn't want to see and it no I more. Don't give, Jesus Christ! But you gotta let. See, this is where like y'all just let it go, both y'all. And it's really on her because she's like she just she keeps saying the same thing. Like you gotta let it go, beloved. But he won't let it go either. They won't. This is what we call not standing down. Not, this is what we call standing your ground and not let and, and not walking away. Sometimes <laughs> you got to know when to hold them, know when to fold them. Know when to walk away, know when to run. You never haunt your money. When you're sitting at the table, be done on the counting. And when the deal is done, come on, man. Understand. I she understand posts, 100%. Posts, 100%. Posts, I don't give a shit. All right, all right, all right. Let me, let me okay. just mediate Thank real fast. Real I fast. understand. Trust this me. Is I understand. Okay. Shay, Shay. No, relax. I understand. I will, I will tell you this because I, I still follow him on Instagram. Uh, he makes fun of everybody. Uh, no, he don't. He does. He does. He, he just now, calls up on top of him. Yeah, like, so whether he, you know, I mean, I, I guess you can try to make an argument that he disproportionately insults black women more, makes jokes on them more, but he makes fun of everyone. Um, 
And, you know, I kind of, this is kind of, you know, the issue, like, if you don't like content, just don't watch it, and that's it. You know what I mean? You and I unfollow. Like that's why I, I don't watch it, but I just wanted to address him for it. I'm going to be honest. I didn't know he would be here tonight. I always wanted to question him that. He texts my phone and asks me and check up on me just to make sure that I'm good, and I respect that. But I don't reply because I simply don't respect him more because he's just the fact that what he posts on the gram, and it's just like, okay. what you texting me for, and you do all this to try to play black women like they just, just always ignorant it or don't fucking and no shit like you can't do because that he cares. Period. think about it listen to what you if you said. care Check you wouldn't downplay it okay, you, if you, you care you wouldn't he downplay it he's like trying to benefit in your this image though I, 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 can we just have this debate please nobody else but no. you're not <laughs> definitely not unless you're black i don't want you to have the debate that's why i said once again i'm mad that this is not in a black a black congregation because only i only want black folk talking right now well, I don't want nobody else talking about trying to better. How is he bettering your image? Explain that to me. How is he bettering your image? Is he an image consultant now? Is he a makeup artist now? Is he a publicist now? How is he bettering your image? Come on, man. Come on, man. But I do agree with him that you just gotta let it go. She's not letting it go. She's not. She's not gonna let it go. We know right now. She's just not gonna let it go. This is where you're a where you're a host. This how. This is what you call pivot. <laughs> Shout out Ross from Friends. Pivot. This is where you pivot, or uh, stay on your pivot, or you can stay on your pivot. Shout out to Urban Politics, Urban Politicians TV. Y'all watch different things, but uh, stay. This <laughs> they're gonna stay. I guess you're gonna stay on that pivot. They're not gonna pivot. You're gonna stay on the pivot. So, but as hosts, you'd be like, okay, we we have been on this for like 15 minutes. Let's go. On. But. This when I right. speak, you're telling me what I should be doing instead of asking me why I do it. And I asked you why. And when I accept it, when I I asked you, you why. That was my first even question. Even now, when I'm saying, when I say, I asked you why. And when I, I asked you why. And when I, and I asked you why. And I asked you why. Continue. All right. So, Shay, right. simply put, he makes his content. You might not like how he disproportionately and makes fun of black him. women. But okay. yeah, you have the right to do that. I mean, the facts. Yeah, so <laughs> it's just a little, yeah, yeah. like, it's like you're, you're, it's like, if you're, if you don't like something, just don't watch it. You know I don't. I mean? That's why I unfollowed two weeks ago. Yeah, I don't so, want to see it, so, but I didn't right. know he would be here to ask him that question today. Okay. Yeah, not okay. exactly. Okay. What I'm she wanted clarity. All right. Well, That's no, okay, she, cool. I think that she wants to be able to control the person. Because I don't want to control clarity, it. I just want to know why. So once again, this, they could have moved on. They could have pivoted. This whatever dumbass topic they wanted to. But he can't let it go. So now he's not letting it go. Once again, ego. Evil, guided, obstacles. Ego. But go ahead. Girl didn't want to date me. If she says it, that's the answer. Not to argue with this girl as she states it. Mm. You Tommy, know what, well, what you should uh, do. Uh, no, Tommy, you shouldn't. Tommy that funny that as fuck, saying, though. Tommy, it's it's really as funny as fuck because, like, he... We you get an get answer to a question. You know what I I, I would well, not I even get it. You, a, you got an answer to a question. You ask why do like, I post I what I post? You got an answer. So bad, I'm okay. not to okay. This is the most ridiculous like, shit in the world. He talk about so many black people on his platform, but this nigga was trying to fuck a bad bitch like me. Like stop playing. Like do he you hear me, this shit? He flew me to him and your friend. And my friend. And so fuck what your saying? friend. Why the hell are and you, you sitting here doing me. this? And you didn't fuck me. So why are you doing this? Right? What's what she doing? Right? Niggas was trying Yo, to act like you. Like, like, niggas was trying to act like you. Like, 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 just like a, just like a comment. Why did everybody, every time I hear about this podcast, somebody getting flewed out in, is this like a thing? Is this like a, a circle you have? Like, is this like a, a group, like a group thing, group part thing you have? Every time I hear this podcast is brought up, Somebody got flewed out. It's, it's like, I find that to be interesting. But anyway, yeah, she'd be a pity as a motherfucker right now. Like, she's like, okay, you know what? Grenade! Poo! <laughs> yeah, this is like, this could have, once again, if Tom, if she just would have accepted his answer, this would have been done. After they, the, the uh, host actually were hosting and being moderators, even though they weren't being moderators, they were just taking time inside. They weren't trying to, and that, and the reason why she's being defensive is nobody's taking her side. She's in a group full of people. Literally, nobody's taking her side. So she's in a group, in a circle. Everybody's saying it's your fault. Don't do this, do that. Nobody's being a true host. Or my race is going to going to play placate the timing side, but also be like, but maybe she feels like 
But nobody's taking her side, so now she's like, okay, nobody's going to take my side, or I'm by myself? Okay, cool, then let's do this thing. So that's what... In, but, go ahead. How am I trying to act? 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 Let's be honest, Shay. This is why... Sit down. You got to sit down, beloved. Like, <laughs> sit, please sit down, beloved. This is why black bitches get kicked out of clubs and shit. I don't give a fuck what I'm going to This is how you, and you wonder why she feels the way she do. I wouldn't like. It's just hey, you feel how you feel, but just like, I'm just not never gonna be on a platform to where I'm going to downgrade. I'm going to hold brothers and sisters accountable, but I'm never going to downgrade them. I'm gonna hold them accountable. Yes, you get your jokes off. Yes, you be funny, but just like. Truth. You're, you're acting, acting stupid. stupid. I'm not acting stupid. Yes, you are. I'm not. Once again, it's the third time now. So you're dumb. You're acting stupid. You're insane. Once again, words. Once again, the angry black woman. Things that. And you wonder why. But go ahead. Why are you getting so mad? This is stupid. Why are you so mad? You're being dumb. <laughs> it's you're so being ignorant. I'm not being ignorant. Oh it's is this how you have a conversation? You're being ignorant. You're being dumb. That's how you have a conversation? That's how you have a civil debate? You be ignorant, you being dumb. Okay. <laughs> Bitch, you flew to my house. You said you wanted exactly. to fuck. Exactly. I didn't go. I, I didn't left the fucking messages where I said this I wanted to fuck. You literally did. No, I did What's not. What's the good? You Yo, told me stupid. that we were going this on a podcast is, for your Yo, show on OnlyFans. Wait, 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 this is yeah. fucking dumb. I got all the receipts in my phone. No, somebody I can dead ass pull that shit out. And she's a porter potty. No, I'm not a porty potty. Tell me what nigga shit it on me. shut up. Tell me what nigga shit. No, because. It's you want truth. people to know. You are bad. wanting to let somebody You're, know I tried to fuck you. This is stupid. Right. Because right. I want right. 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 to follow him. And I didn't fuck him on OnlyFans. I didn't want to fuck him. Is your weed that tight today, man? Is the glue fucking with you? You just paid me. Do you hear me? This bitch is drunk and acting stupid. I'm not drunk. I'm dead ass not drunk. You dead ass drunk and stupid. I promise to God. That weed too tight. You need a different kind of glue. God knows I'm not drunk right now. God knows I'm not Bitch, just up there no, just being ignorant for no reason. No, no, no. He not finna try to play me on Who's the playing you, stupid you? bitch? No, oh, bitch, you fuck. <sighs> so I like to have civil debates. So where we gonna have disagreements. <laughs> oh. Nobody's oh. Uh. Now, I'm gonna actually do this. I'm gonna show this in slow motion for you. Just, I just want you to watch. I'm not going to say nothing. I just want you to watch this. Oh, oh, Pay attention now. What the what hell are you doing? Oh, okay. Oh, I think she's, um, okay. I, want, I know why you did that. But, now, is this a brother that, uh, seems to have your best interest at heart? <laughs> Literally trying to fight. That's a female. Literally trying to fight a female. Oh, I'm sorry. You got to say that's still female today. Women. Black queen. I know you don't like that, but literally trying to got buck and trying to fight a black woman. That's who you unfollow, sis. <laughs> Had a disagreement with you. You did hit him. I'm never, I'm ne never, 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 never going to get it. Never going to get it. Never going to get it. I'm never going to be okay with anybody putting their hands on anybody. So I understand being feeling away, especially when you're intoxicated and you feel embarrassed. You feel, and somebody hitting you, nah, nah. <laughs> so yeah, I'm never going to be okay with that. But at the same time, we're not gonna. We're not gonna try to get bucked. I'm trying to fight a female, though. Like we're just not gonna do that. So yeah, she's definitely in the wrong for that, for sure. In the wrong for that. She's definitely in the wrong. <laughs> she's definitely in the wrong for that. Like don't put put keep your hands, put your hands on your head. <laughs> um. Mm mm mm. 
You're trying to fight a female. I can't get up. You really trying to fight a woman, though. You really did. You really trying to fight a woman. I will show you one more time. I don't know why she's trying to hit him, though. Like, that's weird. Like, this is this is, this is this has got out of hand real quick. We're going to just speed up just a little bit. See how this progressed. Oh, My question is, what would you have did if those security was not there? Tom, brother Tommy, what would you have did if the security or whatever was not there? What would you have did? These are the type of people. There are your influencers trying to tell you that they're teaching, they're teaching, they're reaching, they're educating. <laughs> These are the type. Same, same one that was trying to talk about placating of black women and women and telling them you're beautiful. And they love the man, dude. It got caught cheating. Mr. Jackson. Oh, I ain't for real. <laughs> Sorry, Mr. Jackson. Oh, I ain't for real. Never meant to make your daughter cry. I apologize a trillion times. I'm sorry, Miss Jackson. Ooh, <laughs> I am for real. These are the people that we're following. Just be mindful of your following. Be mindful of that. Like, comment, subscribe, share, all the things, all the things. Balance. Keyword today. Balance. Okay? These people are clearly not <laughs> emotionally imbalanced. <laughs> They're not balanced. Balance is the word of the day. Ain't gotta go home. But you gotta get the hell out of here. Hey, Sue Wavy, baby. Peace.